Francis Tracy, Francis from Nova Scotia Living, Mays and uh, Boris and Violet are out there, and you know, the rest of the crew. But I have been up for a while, it's around 11 o'clock, 10.30, 11 o'clock I think now. I got up around 7.30, did my walk, had my vinegar, had my coffee. I edited a video, which was a big deal. I got the dishwasher going now. What else did I do? Just stuff like that. I've just been banging stuff off, uh, which I feel really good about. And this crap here, I've been procrastinating about wrapping because i got to send it back to Amazon. And time's getting due before you can't send it back anymore. So, yeah, um, I don't have, like, the big packing tape. So I just had, like, scotch tape, only not scotch. Uh, so when I go down to the post, um, they usually have, like, a big thing of tape so I can really secure it good. Nice stop place. So I'm going to run down there soon because I think they go for lunch around 11.30. I don't know what time it is. What time is it? But my, I'm glad I got that video done. Oh, it's 10.53. So I might pop down there now to get that done. Uh, I know to my hair. And just be... Yeah, it's one of those things that's not hard to do. It's just to sit down to do it and be done with it. Otherwise, it's easy to just stuff stuff in a corner and leave it there. Um, so I'm just trying to be proactive and deal with my crap i got to deal with. So that's what I did. job and a half. Empty those, empty that, all those baskets. <sighs> yeah, now it all needs to go away, but the kids are all home so they can bring up all their stuff. Ooh, all right guys, it's about 12.30. I had to update the computer that's downstairs that Messiah plays on, like the security service and all that stuff. So I did that and that took a while to do because computer restarts and reinstalls and all that stuff. Violet just about had an accident on the floor, which she doesn't do. Like she was making the pose to poop, if you know what I'm saying. She had a poop this morning, but she came out, she had a bit of a loose stool. I know you guys all want to know that. So I have them outside and she's acting a little funny. Like she's fine now, but before she was just sitting down, she just wanted to sit down. So I have her tied away from Boris because if she doesn't want to run around, she doesn't have to run around. But as you can see, he wants to run around. Um, last night, though, well, like early morning, it was thundering and lightning here. Holy cow, my bedroom window's open a smidge. It was loud. Anyways, my chair is wet, so I'm sitting on some plastic bags. And um, I have a carbonated water. I'm going to go get my uh, new book that I start. I briefly started like 10 pages yesterday. It's by Mo Hader. It's a Jack Cafferty series it's almost like one of those uk british like uk uh like um thriller shows like shetland or uh you know those kind of shows what is another one i watched oh for heaven's sakes i can't even think of it but one of those detective shows with gruesome things anyways there's five or six books in the series i'm on book number two i read the first book all the books don't, there are different stories in each one. It's just the same detective and a few, like his wife and stuff. Um, so I am starting that book. It's called The Treatment. Uh, and we'll see 
we'll see how that goes. But I didn't bring it out with me right now. So I'll probably go in there and maybe read a little bit. Bring it out here and read a bit. Just to make sure Violet's done doing the do as much as she can do kind of thing. I don't want any accidents like that in the house if I can help help it. Now she never does that. Like it's like it's obviously an accident. Of course you're going to get all tangled up and I'm going to have to untangle you. Yeah, that's what I'm going to have to do. He shortened his chain. because. Yeah, keep going that way. You'll untangle yourself. Anyways, I'll be back in a bit. All right, it's going on 3 o'clock. I was just looking in my freezer what I could make for supper. There's a little bit of leftover spaghetti in there, but not everybody wants spaghetti, I don't think. So there's not enough there for everybody anyways. But I had got these a while ago. They're in my freezer. They're barbecue chicken steam buns, like dumplings or whatever. I'm going to steam them in my steamers like I usually do broccoli. All right, you guys. Um, that's Misha and Maze, you know, with the two pot kind of thing, seven to nine minutes until heated through. Let's stand one minute. All right. I still haven't made those things yet. Mally just boiled some eggs earlier. I'm just waiting for them to be done. That frying pan's the lid to the pot, but I need that pot to fit one of my strainer things that go on, like steamer pots. Um, and it's still only early, like it's only early, just a little, little after three. I want a coffee so bad. I don't have any decaf or I would, but I make myself a coffee. That's how bad I want one. And I don't generally have two coffees a day, or if I do, it's not on a regular basis. But I'm making a coffee because that's what I want. Um, yeah, I just polished off the last two of the deviled eggs I made the other day. And it was delicious. And now I want some coffee, something with a little bite. And then after about a half hour, I'll throw those barbecue chicken things in the steamers and let them go. I don't know. I could cut up some cucumber like as a side. I don't know what I would eat with that. Like what they will. I'm not eating this, but they might. I don't know. I have to figure something out. All right. I got those eggs out of the pot for Mally, but still the pot, bottom part of the pot, like with water. I have two, like, strainers. I say strainers, but you know, those things. There. Maze is playing basketball. His hoop hooked up, like, hanging off the bathroom door. So, that's going on. So, take a spray of things. What? Can I get that netful of Christmas on my boat bag? Christmas for Christmas. Christmas. Thank you. Christmas. Isn't that cute? Doesn't that look neat? They look like cookies. Spritz cookies. Can I see them? Wow. Look like icing. Like this fancy icing. Yeah. They're adorable. Hopefully they're good. But don't overcrowd. So I might have to do this in two batches. I don't just want to overcrowd. But it's only early anyway, so. Space them a little bit apart. One. Oh, I forget if I told you I went down to the post office earlier. Did I tell you that? Anyways, I did, and I sent back all of them except one. I didn't realize it was UPS. So I called like a local delivery guy. I'm like, do you guys pick up prepaid UPS things? And they said yes. I said I have a package here, so they're going to come sometime today. I said, do you know what time? My doorbell doesn't work, right? And she's like, no, but if you're not going to be home, just leave it outside your door. So even though I'm home, I put it in like a recycle bag, a clear bag, and set it out on that covered porch door there, because that's usually where they drop stuff anyways. So it hasn't started raining, but it feels like it's going to rain. So 
But hopefully they'll be here soon. I'll go check to see if it's been picked up yet. I didn't hear them. And Violet and Horace would usually bark if it's time. I'll just set these back in the box just so. I'll get you off so you can get a thing. So uh, all of the other stuff went back. I'm just hoping that thing is picked up today. So I will be all done. I'm going to put the lids on these. I'll show you first. Yeah. Cute as a button, isn't it? Um, so I am going to just put a lid on these and turn them up on high and go out and finish my coffee. Ooh, baby, these things are pumping. Don't even think about it. All right. It said seven to nine minutes. I put the timer for 15 minutes just because I went out there to drink my coffee and the water was cold in the bottom of the pot so it would have time to come up. So hopefully they're done. I don't know what they're supposed to look like. I have no idea. But I have plates out already. And what I did, I gently sprayed just a little bit of it too because I don't want them sticking to the plate. I don't know if I should have did that or not. I don't know. But that's what I did. And then I will just put some cucumber on or something. Something. Oh, I don't want to ruin them. They look so fancy. four for now. No. No, sir. There's only two left here, but I'm going to do the rest of them. I got to see how much water is left in here. Oh, yeah, there's enough. There's still enough. Spread it out a bit. That's friggin' hot. Bye. Bye, hold it. There we go. There. That's done. Now I need to finish putting stuff on their plates. All right. It's kind of a weird supper, but we got some cucumber. And I'm trying to use up some of the lunch goodies that I have just because I'm not packing lunches anymore this summer, like for camps. So goldfish, why not? Why not? So it's going to be eggs. No, Mally's making egg salad sandwiches with those eggs. Um. Oh, I just want to check to see if that's gone. Please be gone. It's gone. Yay, I'll return. I wish I'd have seen him. I can't imagine somebody porch sweeping here. They wouldn't dare. I have a force field up. They will have uh, uncontrollable spontaneous diarrhea if they do. So, anyways, yeah, it's gone. Hip hip hooray. Well, good morning, friends. It's Tracy from Nova Scotia Living, or it's the next day. All the Randalls are around. There's about eight of them. And it's garbage day. But I happen to 
peek in here and these two little buggers are in here again. I even pulled it away from here so they couldn't climb up on top. <sighs> Hi, sweetheart. I'm going to let you out, but I'm going to be busy working. And those crows are making an awful racket. All right. You must have had a good feed, though, did you? One of them's looking at me. Oh, babies. The other one looks like he's sleeping. Sleeping in that muck. Oh, that's a lot of garbage. And five, five big recycle bags, five or six. All right, Randall, you're safe to go get your peanuts now. I'm going in. There was one right there. They're all around me. There's a whole bunch. It's probably not enough for everybody, but I'll come up with some bread later. I don't want to use up all my peanuts until I get more. Ooh, I'm out of breath. It's only like 7 o'clock. I had my alarm set to make sure I got up so we didn't miss that GD garbage day. And we didn't miss it. You guys just stay, you birds stay out of the garbage. Okay, love ya. All right. Ah, we went for a walk, but when I'm doing that, they always want to come and then they start hooting and hollering and then the raccoons were there and then all the randals are there. And I'm just like, you guys can watch from the window. Yeah. All right, guys, I came in, um, I made myself a coffee. I did have a shot of vinegar. I put TV for dogs on. There. There. All that garbage is out, so that's exciting. I was, like, really looking forward to garbage day, even though I'm like that every week. But since we had so much from cleaning out the side of the shop and stuff, um, yeah, amazing. It's quite an adrenaline rush. Um, that book I was telling you I was reading yesterday was, uh, The Treatment by Mo Hader, so. I'm more than halfway through. So, it's a weird-shaped book. It's, uh, the size of, like, a store paperback, but it's wider. I don't have one here to compare it to, but it's like a square, almost. Not quite, but it's wider than a regular... Well, is it? I don't know. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Anyways, it's a weird shape book. This is the only book in my whole library that is shaped like this. But, um, yeah, it's quite disturbing in the criminal sense, you know, with criminal stuff. But, um, yeah, I'm going to have my coffee and just relax a little bit. I could have slept in today, but I really didn't want to miss that, and I wanted to make sure I got all of it. So, I did. It's out there. There's even, like, a broken shovel and, you know, just a bunch of stuff like that that just has been kicking around. So, it'll be history today, which will be great. Anyways, I will be back. I need to um, unload my phone. There's not much room left on my phone, but I will do that after. Oh. All right, guys, I have not checked back in quite some time. It's 12.30. I've been busy this morning. I gave Maze a bath when he got up and made him breakfast and all that jazz. Um, I have been editing a video, the video with us going to the lake in that dinner theater. It was a lot of editing on that one. Um, so it's just exporting now. I'll click it to upload later. And um, I took out a package of chicken breast. Mally asked me to, so I did. And what else? just made me some lunch and yeah anyways I'm outside with Violet and Boris now I have a carbonated water strawberry lime and I'm gonna read my book I'll finish that Mo Hater one up I think I'm gonna jump right into the second well it's actually the third book in the series but I'm kind of on a thriller kick right now um, at least for right now read a couple of those just to get um, a couple of the other books that I read out of my system. Not that they were bad, like I said. That Collide book and that Stillwater Lake, it was good. But, um, yeah, it was good. And there is a second book, but I don't really have any urge to go read another one. Maybe someday. It's like a 
middle of the road. I'm neither here nor there about it. It was good. But I wasn't jazzed about it, if you know what I'm saying. So, um, yeah, anyways. Violet, what do you have? Oh, just a all right, guys, I have not checked back in a long time. It's 5.30. Um, I'm taking Maze to soccer for 6. I'm just stopping to Sobeys to get some prescriptions for Saritha. And then Mally's with me, too. She wanted to come in, so Misha's there. Isaiah's home. I'm hoping the pharmacy's still open. They have weird hours now. It's not open. I thought it stayed open till 6. Must have closed at 5. Well, that's friggin' disappointing. I see them in the back there, but their systems are probably all shut down. Damn it. Now, I know she's good till Sunday for her. Look, they have Halloween chips out now. She's good till Sunday for her prescriptions. So, we'll have to come in tomorrow because the pharmacy's closed on the weekends for crying out loud. So that's wonderful. Oh, small town living. What you gonna do? Mary's with me. Misha Mays ran over here already. Oh gosh. back over here. Mally's over there with Maze. Oh. It's a beautiful day though. It really is. Alright, we got to the soccer field about 15 minutes early. Oh, I stopped. Well, yeah, you were there. The friggin' pharmacy's closed. What is this car doing? So yeah, pharmacy's closed, but I thought that would have taken a little more time, but that's all right. So we got the choice spot to put our chairs. I'm cutting across the grass. Oh, Canada, our home and native land. Patron love and all our sons come back with glowing hearts we see the rise of true north strong and free from far and wide oh Canada we stand on guard for thee Alright, they're all out there doing exercises and stuff, strategies, you know, drills, whatnot. I don't know if you can see, but Maze is in the middle. Like there's a group here, the middle group, and then the fair group. He's in the middle. Try to zoom in on him. No, that's not him. He's the one with the yellow ball. Yeah, that's him. <clears throat> Alright, we just got home. My husband had a little grocery haul here waiting for me, so... I'll show you what he got in town. He must have got back before I did. Or, yeah, before I got here. Because the stuff's still cold and everything. Um, this is probably all from Superstore. Well, the meat is. Yeah, I'm sure it's all from Superstore. This was six seventy four. So, guess what we'll be having tomorrow? This one was five eighteen, And it's seven sixty nine a kg. Oh, gosh. This hamburger. This is from Sobeys. Uh, eleven ninety eight. It's nine ninety a kg. Family size. Tisk tisk. This doesn't belong there. Um, he got three things of cheese. I don't know the prices of this stuff, but old cheddar, marble, and old cheddar. Two things of those big packs of hot dogs. So we have those. Two things of honey garlic sauce, which will be good. Two things of pancake mix, original and buttermilk. A thing of onions that were 50% off. And I think that's everything. He got brought these home last night. They're quahogs, quahogs. Uh, it's seafood, like those giant. 
they look like giant clams or something. Um, anyways, they're canned up. Some, some fella down the front shore, I believe, cans them up and sells them. He ate a jar of them last night, I think. So, anyways, I need to put this stuff away. And Violet and Boris are eating their supper now. So, yeah, I'm going to put this away. Well, good morning, friends. It's Tracy from another day. I'm just putting an ending on this. I just had my morning coffee. I'm sitting here editing that video. I'm getting that's kind of a tradition about a few days. I get my coffee. I go get up, go for a walk, have my shot of vinegar, make a coffee, and then come up here and have my coffee and edit a video. So, so far that's working. So I can be on top of the game. But, um, yeah. Yeah, that was just me hanging out, uh, getting some stuff done. Yeah, those steam buns that I did uh, the first day, like that was two days in that video. Um, the kids ate them, but it was too sweet. It was barbecue chicken, and it was like sweet barbecue. If it wasn't so sweet, I'd probably get it again, but I won't bother getting those again just because, yeah, it was just, just too sweet. That's all. They weren't bad, just they were too sweet for us. We're not, uh, we don't need that much sweet for our barbecue, I guess. Some people really like that kind of stuff. Not, not so much us, but anyways, I want to say peace, love, and happiness today and every single day. Please like, share, and subscribe if you so choose, but if not, that's okay too. I still love you. I still want all the happiness in the world for each and every one of you out there. I certainly do. I really, really honest and truly do. Yes, I do. So. Okay, guys, well, with that, I'm going to say have a good night or have a good morning, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye! Boink.